And tonight we are hearing from the Department of Natural Resources about the first positive case of chronic wasting disease here in Georgia. This came from a sample collected on the Berrien Lanier County line in South Georgia. CWD is a neurological disease. It affects deer and moose. It has an 18 to 30 month incubation period and it is deadly. So the sample was collected late last year and then they recently learned it was positive. The Georgia Department of Natural Resources discussed their response with state lawmakers today. They say that the sample was collected during routine surveillance. The routine surveillance system has been in place for about 20 years and they do say it's working. They say that the case of CWD is something that they've been preparing for identified exactly where the deer was harvested <coughs> down to this is where this deer was taken. Um, we've reached out our staff down there on the on the ground have reached out to the landowners within a one mile radius or about 3000 or so acres. Those folks have been contacted one on one. We've also reached out to area meat processors and taxidermists. As most of y'all know, our season, our firearm season just recently ended and we were hopeful that we could get a few more samples just from what they had in their freezers and coolers and uh, 11 processors and taxidermists were contacted and from that we were able to get an additional seven samples. So far, Georgia is now the 36th state to have a positive case of CWD. Officials say that their positive deer hunting will continue to thrive in Georgia.